Tech Island is presented to you by Suzuki, Cebu, and www.fineupgrades.com. Global technology within reach. Welcome to another episode of Tech Island, where we bring you the latest and the greatest gadgets today. I'm Ryan, your host. Today we're going to be featuring one very cool gadget, which is an improvement of what we featured before. But before that, let me introduce you to our new guest, our mascot here at Tech Island. We still have to come up with a name for him. Maybe you have a name for him. You can email us at techisland at gmail.com. Here, let me give you a closer look. This is a bearded dragon, native of Australia, and uh, is one of the common reptile pets all over the world today. It's very cute. It grows up to about 20 inches, and it eats crickets and worms and vegetables. It doesn't bite, and it's the only reptile to date that will actually uh, find humans entertaining or they like to be with humans. See? Can you take a closer look at that? Oh, it's, it's shy. It's closing its eyes. And I can just leave him there. And he's just going to hang on. Again, this is a bearded dragon. And um, he was brought to us by Piper's Pet Shop in Vanilla. So if you want to look at more of these exotic pets and fishes and all the sorts, you can check it out at Piper's Pet Shop way in Vanilla. Thanks for this bearded dragon, our new mascot here at Tech Island. So now let's uh, go down to the details. We're going to bring you uh, this gadget called the Honeywild Media Player. Uh, if you remember before, way back, uh, we, used to, we featured a device called the MediaGate. The MediaGate is a hard drive player, and this is an improvement of that. It's also a hard drive player, but what makes it different? Check this out. Today, we're going to talk about high definition. High definition, or HD, video, generally refers to any video system of higher resolution than standard definition, SD video. Most commonly at display resolutions of 1280 by 720, or otherwise called a 720p, and 1920 and 1080, or otherwise known as 1080i or 1080p. High definition video, pre-recorded and broadcast, is defined threefold by the number of lines in the vertical display resolution. High definition television, or HDTV resolution, is 1080 or 720 lines. In contrast, regular digital television or DTTV is 480 lines, upon which NTSC is based. 480 visible scale lines out of 525, or 576 lines upon which PAL or SECAM are based on. In other words, high definition means more lines on your television. The more lines, you see, when you, when you walk closer to your television, you will see the lines on your TV. And the, the farther you are, the lines disappear. Well, on high definition television, the lines, the closer you are, the lesser lines you see, which is good, meaning the picture is clearer and more vivid. The colors are brighter as well. There are two kinds of scanning systems, progressive scanning and interlace scanning. To make it simpler, interlace is sort of like a, the computer or the, the processor inside the player, whichever player you have, does the scanning for you, meaning it automatically adds lines in between to make your picture look clearer. Unlike progressive scanning, wherein it is the actual lines appearing from the video in itself. If you don't get what I mean, don't worry. We're going to show you some examples later of how clear HDTV is. So the reason why I've been telling you about HDTV is because nowadays you see LCD TVs everywhere. When you go to the mall, they're always on sale. And people are just buying LCD TVs. Those thick CRT TVs, you won't see them anymore. Well, you still see some TVs, those thick ones, those called CRTs. But uh, most likely, you will not buy them anymore when you see slick LCD TVs like these. And the reason why you buy LCD TVs are two things for us here at Tech Island. Number one, you save on electricity and you save on space. Well, that's actually two. But I consider that as one, electricity and space. Secondly, it's for a video quality. The reason why you want to upgrade to an LCD TV is because the picture is clear, more crisp, the colors are more vivid, and everything is just, you know, smooth to the eyes. That's why you want to buy HDTV. Our problem here is when you buy an HDTV LCD TV, you don't have the input. What I mean is 
uh, if you watch local television TV, it's just giving you a very low resolution of about 420p, which is or 480p somewhere there, which is giving you crappy signals. You will never appreciate LCD TVs looking at those. Now, when you go to the malls, you have to make sure to ask a salesperson what input they are playing on the TV. Because if they're just playing it from an ordinary DVD player, you won't appreciate the quality of the LCD TV. Try to ask a salesperson what resolution your LCD TV is. Usually, they'll have a big sticker here up front saying that it's 1080p. If it is, then buy it. Make sure that when you're buying an LCD TV, it's 1080p because that is the highest form of resolution up to date that the players can provide. Which players can provide such, a, such good quality videos? You have the Blu-ray players and HD DVD. But as you know, there was a battle between HD DVD and Blu-ray and which one would become the standard. And the Blu-ray has won. Now that you know that Blu-ray format is one of them, it's time to buy a Blu-ray player, right? That's a problem. You know how much one would cost? It would cost you about 20, 30, 40,000 just for a Blu-ray player. That's why most people nowadays have bought the Sony PlayStation PS3. Did I say that? PlayStation PS3 or the PS3. It's the same thing. Well, anyway, that player can play games, the Sony games, and of course, it can also play uh, Blu-ray movies. That's why people are opting that instead of a, just a pure uh, Blu-ray player instead. But here at Tech Island, we found a good... Uh, a good uh, replacement for that, if you'd allow me to say. What is it? It's the Honeywild Blu-ray player. Now, let's get down here to show you what it's, what, how it looks like. Now, this is the Honeywild Media Player. What makes it different from the previous media players that we presented is it can play the MKV file. As you all know, there are different file formats that you download movies off the internet, like DivX or XVID, usually in a shell form called AVI. Well, Honeywild can play a new shell form called Matroska. What is Matroska? Matroska is an open standard free container format, a file format that can hold an unlimited number of video, audio, picture, or subtitle tracks inside a single file. Most Blu-ray rips or HD DVD rips or high definition rips can fit inside a Matroska file. That's what makes it different. The Matroska file is also a very large file type, meaning it will really take a processor good enough to process all the video and audio inside that particular shell. So what this player, what makes this player special is it can do that exactly while all the other media players can. The Helios DVD upscaling video. Now what makes it different from all the other DVD players out there is it upscales the video to a higher resolution. Meaning if you have an ordinary DVD, it's going to make it appear like an HD video on TV, which is actually pretty good. Now. Here at Tech Island, we actually recommend two players. One is the one that we, I previously mentioned, which is the Honeywild Media Player, or the HTPC, which is uh, this last one over here. What is the HTPC? Well, if you want to know more about the HTPC, check out our previous episode where we had a full feature on the HTPC. And inside this HTPC as well is a Blu-ray player already in the form of an optical drive of a PC. It's actually a DVD writer as well and a Blu-ray player, and it can play CDs and all the sorts. It's also, it also comes with a remote. Now here in the center, back to the Honeywild, it's a, it's a trimmed down version of that. You see, most people, like, uh, well, like I, I'd give my dad as an example, they're actually still learning how to operate these things, so they, but they do know how to operate a DVD player, which is what the Honeywild can do. All your downloaded data can be played as simple as operating a DVD player. So what we have here in front of us are three players that we recommend that you use to play on an LCD TV. So this is the Honeywild Full HD Wi-Fi. Well, there's a Wi-Fi version and there's a non-Wi-Fi version. A networking media player. It's called the PowerZis HD301 here. Now, all the things that you need to know about is actually here at the back. As you can see, you can connect all sorts of machines to it. You can connect your PC. Uh, it becomes a network storage device, meaning if you plug it to your network, uh, you can actually just copy files to and from your PC. Now, let me elaborate on that. Um, on a network, uh, if you saw my previous episode, which was about the Powerline network uh, thing, I hope you saw it. It's really good. If not, just check it out on our website. Uh, we have it on, we have, by the way, we have Tech Island on YouTube already. So just search it there and you'll find it. It's a Tech Island channel, all right? So you'll see all our videos there. Anyway, uh, back to the networking part. If you connect